Cool. All right, my friend, that's it for the second part of our four part training series all about table view. I hope that you enjoyed this video. It is getting excited, right? We are going to be the complete photo mania app. We are starting. So I want you to do just one thing right now. Just scroll down the video in the comment section post something there for me so that I know that you are here just build the community around here because I know that a lot of people are watching this video so I want to know that you are here just say something about this video do you like it what do you want to learn more what is the most uh, what is the thing that you learn the most in this video what would you love to learn more just post anything there for me so that I know that you are here, so that I know that you are learning, that you are with me. So post anything there for me, share it with your friends, share it with your developers. Next, in the next uh, a couple of days, I think three days, I am going to send you part three of this series, part three of this series. So watch for my email, another email from me, part three of this four part training series all about table view. So I can't wait to see you in part three of this series in which we are going to learn how we can build the complete photo mania app. It's not really complete, but we having the own the basic foundation set up. We we'll learn about how to create a dynamic table view cell, a customized table view cell, displaying beautiful photo with beautiful uh, images and caption and photo profile image view. Wow, this is wonderful. You have been going so far. We have accomplishing a lot. So I want to congratulate you. I want I honor you for being here. And I can't wait to see you in part three of this series.